Thank you, Tabbed. Happening today, a change in leadership at the Tulsa County Sheriff's Office. Two Works for You anchor Max Resnick is live outside of the Sheriff's Office with more on the road ahead for Vic Regalado. Max. Tonight, good morning. After claiming victory in last week's special election, Sheriff elect Vic Regalado becomes the first Tulsa County Sheriff to be elected since 1988. And we should expect him to make his imprint almost immediately. He told us last week that he plans to name some new managers as soon as he steps into office. He says he has a 90 day plan to address budget problems and the issues with the jail. Additionally, Regalado wants to improve morale in the office and restore its reputation. He'll need to do just that. The issues with the office are well documented from the Eric Harris shooting by a reserve deputy to a grand jury investigation and resignation by then Sheriff Stanley Glanz, followed by a nearly 240 page external assessment of the TCSO, highlighting numerous issues within the department and a state audit that found misuse of taxpayer dollars. Regalado has a lot to tackle and he'll only have a short time to do it. He's already got to plan his reelection bid with a primary in June and general election in November. Republican Luke Sherman announced he'll run again and has the backing of four other former sheriff's candidates. Democrat Rex Berry, whom Regalano defeated last week, is also expected to run again. But for the moment today, the focus is on this morning's Tulsa County Commissioner's meeting, where Regalano will be sworn in. We'll be there, of course, and have updates for you online and on the Two Works For You mobile app. Live downtown, Max Resnick, Two Works For You.